Hello everybody, I'm supposed to be a blessing. Today is August the 4th, 2019. This is my video for my Sagittarius. If you're new to my channel, please take a moment to like and subscribe to my channel. When you're done listening to my reading, leave me a comment in the comment section down below because I do read those and I will answer you. If you're interested in your own personal tarot card reading from Miss Bless, call me at 347-227-5723. With that being said, let's get into your reading, Sagittarius. The first card you have is the seven of chalices you have the knight of wands you have the five of wands you also have the eight of wands and you have the star card so right away i said there's plenty of offers that's going to be coming in for you guys that's the knight of swords which is the air sign that's coming toward you here mm -hmm. definitely flying in coming on in too you also have the five of wands this talks about there's a whole lot of competition surrounding you that's Surrounding could have to do with your job or just in your personal life, but there's some type of competition surrounding you here. Eight of Wands is fast communication that's going to be coming in. And the star card that talks about your destiny, you're going to receive help from above here with your destiny. What are your hopes, your wishes, your dreams? Are, you, are they being fulfilled? And it's also a wish card. So go ahead and make your wish. You also have the three of wands. Your ships is coming on the horizon. It tells me that you're standing on solid ground. Here's what this card is saying. You worked extremely hard. It's definitely going to pay off for you here. You have the ace of chalices, which is a new love. That's coming in. Doors of window of opportunities about to open up for you. The moon is represented in this card. Is your intuition is at an all-time high. It is what the fuck it is, y'all. The hermit card is here. And the hermit card tells me that you done isolated yourself to think about people places and things within your life um and you're gonna come up with the answers that you need in regard to that now this is not a pentacles card if you look at this lady got her hand to her mouth you see the bird you know birds are normally messengers so that was a message that you received and somebody told you to keep hush hush about it so it is what it is the nine of pentacles also talks about um the universe is gonna bless you that's right. And sometimes you, if you have big dreams and things of that sort, you're supposed to keep your keep that a secret. Keep it to yourself. Don't be telling everybody because everybody don't be happy for you when you be on your uprise. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, y'all do. You got it. <laughs> y'all the four of chalices here. Somebody could be very bored. I see there's a lot of things that's going on surrounding you here. You see all these animals surrounding you. And something is definitely out of place. So sometimes you're feeling as though you're out of place in regard to something. That's what this card is telling me. I'll say you have the world card. Your world is definitely changing, okay? God priestess is stepping in, and she's saying it's time for you to follow your intuition in regard to everything that's going on in your life. High priestess, she knows all, she sees all. She don't talk much. You see how she's sitting there? Mm-hmm. She knows all, she sees all, and don't say much. Sometimes you got to be like that as well. You also have the page of swords, and the page of swords... It's a young air sign that's coming in, and normally pages come in to bring messages as well. Yeah, see, it's some kind of knowledge that he's bringing, and also you see this right here. Yeah, you're gonna get received knowledge and help from above. You see this right here, right? Come on, show up, right? Damn it, that's an angel bringing knowledge to you about something so it's time for you to pay attention to the universe here the queen of swords is definitely saying that somebody's going to say some mean harsh words mm-hmm angels in this card too as well <laughs> I mean, they might be trying to tell you to mind your manners in regard to what you say to people because you never know who's listening all right um you have the five of swords here and it's in the reverse this was when you didn't draw the line of sand with somebody and somebody's not accepting of that bullshit at all. It just is what it is. I see you're going to receive clarity in regard to things that are going on. Anything that's hitting in the dark will definitely come to the light. And like I said, your intuition is at an all-time high. You could be dealing with a cancer here as well. So let's see here once again. There is, like I said, an air sign that's coming in. Competition. Fast communication coming in. You're thinking about your destiny, where things are going. You're waiting for your ships to come in. They're coming in. New love is coming in, a new beginning. Isolation to yourself to think about things. The universe is going to bless you, but you got to be quiet in regard to whatever the universe is blessing you with. Can't tell everybody until it's already into fruition. The world is changing for you here. The high piece of following your intuition in regard to things that are going on. 
you're going to receive uh, messages from the universe. So pay attention. You're going to say some mean, harsh words to somebody. You're going to say what the fuck you mean to me, what you say it is, what the fuck it is. Whoever you draw the line is saying, well, they, they disagree with this bullshit. So there's going to be some type of um, drama going on with that. And the moon card is say you receive clarity in regard to something that's going on. Well, I hope you enjoyed this reading, Sagittarius. Please like, subscribe, comment to my channel. Share my videos and tell people about Miss Bliss. With that being said, y'all have a blessed day. Thank you.